Well, we're down here at the training ground with AFC Wimbledon development coach Alan Reeves. You've got a signing to announce, Alan. Yeah, uh, we've uh, today Richard Pingling signed. Uh, he's a attacking player. He can play on, you know, can play a front three. He can play anywhere across the front. Um, he's left footed, but can play on the right as well. Um, he's been with us about a month on and off. Um, he has been playing games for Merston as well, uh, non-contract. He was at Burnley as a scholar uh, for the last two seasons. Got released in the summer. Um, so we've been playing as trade at Merston. Um, so we've had him in, he's played four or five games, he's done well. Um, you know, the gaffer's seen him in a couple, and we, we said we'd make a decision after the form game on, on Tuesday this week. And again, you know, he, had, he, he has a good go, uh, he's got some good attributes, um, he's a willing worker, he listens. Uh, but above all else, what got on the contract, he's a good decision maker. You know, he makes the right decisions the majority of the time. And he's shown what he can do up front, he's very lively, but I mean, for yourself as well, what in particular really sort of impressed you because you don't hand out contracts easily here, do you? No, 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 we have, you know, we have uh, trial listing quite regular. Um, you know, we're not going to sign someone for the sake of it because we've got good youth team players here. Um, but he's come in and you can, you can see he's been playing men's football, even though he's only 18, uh, the same age as Jaden Um, You know, you, you can see in his build and his stature and his physique that he's been around, you know, playing a decent standard uh, against men. And it, it's bowled well for him. Um, you know, he's come in. It's a bit daunting for him straight into training with the first team, which is what the young lads do here, uh, the young pros when they come straight into training. And he's taken to it well. Um, but as I said, he, he, he's got loads of, loads of work to do. He's 18 years of age, like, like they all have. But he's a willing learner. He's a good kid. Uh, you don't have to tell him too many times the same thing, which is always good as a coach. You like to see it going in. And listen, who knows? You know, He's got another opportunity. He got released from Burnley. He's got another lifeline now. So a conversation me and the gap have had with him. It's down to you, as always, as a player, it's down to you, so balls in your court. It's important to stress as well, there is a plan, there's a structure in place for what you want to do with the development squad, even though there may be other signings still to come, yeah? Yeah, there is. You don't want to use up, you know, all your budget at your disposal at the start of the season just by bringing players in for the sake of it, just because you've got the money there. Um, you know, we've got a little bit of money put aside, and we've had a couple of injuries, and, you know, unfortunately for Seth and Nez, they're quite long-term injuries, and even young Tom Scott, who's who would have been playing uh, for, the, for the 23s as well. They've all got long-term injuries, so we've addressed it at the last technical board meeting, and Eric said, you know, there's a little bit of money, there's money there we've got put aside in case this happens. So it's happened, unfortunately, for them three lads. So, But we need a team for the 23s, and we can't have the under-18s playing Saturday, Tuesday, Saturday, Tuesday every week. It's not good for them. Um, so we brought uh, RJ in. We have got a little bit of space left for another one or two players, but. We're not going to bring players in for the sake of it. Uh, we'll get more trialists in, have a look at them. It's always difficult this time of the season um, because you know lads are normally settled in their clubs. Um, but as I said, Eric said there's, there's money there available. Um, but we are going to look. But we're going to be very you know studious and how we who we bring in on trial, and then if they're good enough, we'll give them an opportunity.